Tell me if you with it, cause I'm with it, babe. I haven't heard from you, and I'm. Yeah, Alright, let's get ready to do this. Uh, see that? Give my thumbnail. There we go. All right. What's going on, guys? It's your my here, and today we are having a meatball mukbang. Y'all already saw I was making a thumbnail, warming it up, and everything. So I got meatballs and green beans. I already showed it a little bit. I also got me secret sauce. Now this sauce is spicy a little bit. It's supposed to be spicy ranch, but I saw it at the commissary. It is good as hell. Shout out to that. Shout out. It's hella good. Alright, so. And just watch how it drizzles in there. Let's watch it. Alright. Let me try to let me try to get this done. It's been a second, y'all. Doing my bang. Bear with me. Okay. Alright, let's try. Oh, we gotta make we gotta be careful because we got this barbecue sauce right here. We don't wanna spill it. Because if we spill it, we're gonna have us a problem. Alright, watch. Watch how it drizzles. Watch. I can't tilt down a little bit because I'm gonna mess around and hurt the camera. So, yeah. Just know that it's good. I could try to um, make the thumbnail again. I don't know. Let's try it again. All right. We'll see if that one's good. If not, fuck it. <laughs> uh, I've literally done that like two or three times for my bang. So let's get started. Let's get started. Let's get started. Let's get started. All right. Excuse the background. I have TV on right now for my dog because my dog likes to watch TV. So yeah. Okay, green beans are good. I like to start with the green beans first because whenever my whenever they make green beans, I eat the green beans first because I got I get my vegetables out of the way because I'm not a big fan of vegetables that much with green when it comes to green beans. So eat the green beans first, then get into the meatballs. That's how that shit gonna go. But how's everybody doing? I know it's been a sec. Been hella busy. But, um, did you guys see that, um, season seven premiere of Blackish? It was an election special. That was good. I liked it. It was so relevant because election, it's election year and it's just, I think this is the most intense election I think I've ever seen because I've never really been a big election type of person. I've never really been into politics like that. Never. Like all like my child like I was just like okay. Even with the whole um even with Obama being elected for president. I was like, "Oh wow." You know, cuz I was younger. I was really I was younger by the time Obama was elected for president and everything and I was like you know, I was surprised then. I was I really was surprised. I was like, Oh wow, we begin to get a brother in the White House, okay. You know, I was excited. Don't get me wrong, I was excited, you know. It was it was special. First black president in the White House. Black first black family at that. It don't get no better than that. But I don't know. It's just been an intense an intense four years because it's like Y'all, and then I've got so many, I cannot tell you how many notifications I got for vote, 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 when I've already sent my, um, when I already registered my vote already. I can't tell you, I've gotten so many notifications, so many ads, 
on YouTube, Instagram, TikTok, that I can literally make a fucking deck of cards, you know? It's like crazy. All right, let's try this meatball. I want to hurry this up a little bit because my mom gets home and then she works and everything and I got to be quiet and nobody got time for that. So, look at the sauce. Look at the sauce. Look at the sauce. Ooh, that looks good. All right. Take a bite. <laughs> Ooh, that's good. So, yeah. If y'all ever eat meatballs, if y'all ever eat meatballs, get the secret sauce. It's really good. It adds a little spice, so though, if you're not a spicy person, then I don't know what to tell you shit. Mm -hmm. But it's really good. You gotta try it. Okay. But yeah, back to what I was saying. It's an intense year. And those who ain't vote, I'm sorry. If you need a reason as to why for proof after you just witnessed these last four years, nigga, you weird. Nigga, you dumb. What the fuck? Like, you can, please vote. Like, do you really want another four years of going through this shit? Do you really want another four years of going through this? Y'all, vote. Youngins, those of you who are my age, my generation, millennials, vote. Your vote counts. I don't give a fuck what nobody says. Your vote counts. It really does, and it really does matter. So you don't want to end up with assholes like that. So, vote. I don't know how else I can put it to you. I don't know how else I can be fucking blunt with you. Get your ass up and vote. Don't give me no excuse about, oh, I got to take my kids. Nigga, you got plenty of time to vote. You had how many days? How many months? How many weeks? And you can't tell me you can't get a vote in with my all those all those time? Fuck out of here. I'm trying to hear that bullshit. Mm -mm. So, yeah, that was going on. But Blackest Election was um, Black Blackest Special had a cartoon, the second um, part, and then the first part it was basically about Junior. Waiting for, um, I guess his vote wasn't accepted, or his, he, him registering, it didn't really accept him. And he kept, like, it was just speculations of, our, does our vote really count? And are the votes rigged? Or why do they make it where it's hard for us to vote or we cannot vote? So... It was a very interesting episode. Very interesting. I highly recommend you guys watch it. But, I've been hella busy though. That's why I haven't been making a lot of videos. I made, like, last video I made, I've been making like three live streams so far. Try to get my friends into that. That was a fucking bust. And, um, yeah. So, it was just like, I did, um, a live, last live stream with music. And I, I got a lot of good feedback on that. So, thank y'all. Yeah, but, but yeah, other than that, I've been hella busy with work. Work's been going good. Mm. 
Good thing about it is, oh shit, who texts me? Who the hell texts me? Oh, that's just an Instagram. Okay. We not gonna let that disrupt our video, y'all. But. Yeah, not that much has been going on. It's been pretty quiet. You know, from. I just been watching my favorite TV shows. I'm a big Tyler Perry fan, as you guys see. I've watched the haves and have nots this week. Eh, that show's alright. It's going. I don't know. It's dragging. They need to pick it up. Like, it's. Like, these past few seasons with the haves and have nots have really been dragging, and I'm like. I don't understand why. And if I do, like, some, I, like, my friend was saying, you should probably do reviews, like, on shows and stuff like that. Well, if I do re reviews on shows, I'm going to do reviews on shows that are hyping me up and are where it's giving you grenade after grenade after grenade every fucking week. You know, I don't want to review a show that's been dragging. And I'm damn sure not going to review a show who I've been watching for how long. And I'm just going to start a review at season. I don't even know what season is. They keep saying it's season 7. But it's been so many seasons. So it's like, what the hell? You can't even keep up with the fucking seasons. Fuck that, bro. I'm not reviewing that. But I'll still watch it. If I'm watching it this long, why would I stop now? What's going on? Mm. But, yeah. Oh, this big ass spray. Don't overflow. Don't overflow. Don't overflow. Okay. Hmm. <sighs> that. And I also been watching House of Pain and Assisted Living, Tyler Perry. House of Pain is getting good. Assisted Living is it's it's getting better. You know, people was Assisted Living was kind of dragging without Brown and Core, but now that Brown and Core are here, I think it's getting up there. Sisters are supposed to be coming back. I will not be watching Sisters. Nope. Because my opinion, that show fucking sucks. Come for me if you want. I don't like that shit. Fuck that. I do love me the Oval, so. And. The Connors are supposed to be coming back. October 21st. Is what I've heard. I might be wrong. So I'll be watching that. That show is really good. They 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 they're out of season three. They got season three now. People kept saying that show would not last because Roseanne is no longer in there. Oh damn! Hold on. All right, I'm back. Um, it cut off. Hopefully, when I edit, it's going to do fine, but I've just been eating it. And if it does, then we'll, we're just going to continue with what I was talking about. Yes, I'm eating meat, some meatballs. I'm eating meatballs with a secret sauce, Sprite. I'm almost done. I was talking about shows. About what I was watching, haves and have nots. Fuck haves and have nots. I don't really watch that show as much anymore because it's dragging. Um, I watched it. Oh, well, I'm waiting for that to come back. I'm not watching um, Sisters. Fuck that show. Not watching that. Uh, I watched Blackish, The Election. Hella good. Assisted Living is getting better. House of Pain, House of Pain 100%. And the Connors, I was that's where I stopped. The Connors has been doing really good. 
they got they got a season three. Hallelujah. People didn't think they would get there, but they are. are. Excuse me. Sorry. Um, but they are. And people, this that's just prime example there. When you get a spinoff show or a show stops because the lead character or the character that's starting, the starring gets in some shit. Just because that person popped up and they got in their show doesn't mean you can come with a spinoff. Like, I wish they did that with the Cosby shows. Because I used to watch the Cosby show. When Bill Cosby fucked up. The Cosby show was already ended. But they could have done a spinoff or something. Like, that show was iconic. Still is iconic. Roseanne is still iconic. Even if the lead characters are fuck-ups. That shows are still iconic. Because people grew up watching those shows. Those shows came out with my, with my mama, my aunt, or your parents. We're young, like our age. We all won't even, we all may not have been born. Like my age group hasn't probably been born by then, but we still watched a little bit of it. With our parents, with our grandparents. <laughs> That's what pisses me off. When the lead characters fuck up, you take it out on the whole cast. That's what pisses me off. Because how are you going to come for them? Or... Punish them because the lead characters are fuck ups. I don't understand that. Can somebody explain that to me? I'm just asking a simple fucking question. Like, I never understood that. Still won't. Never will understand that fucking content. Never. Mm. They got so many fucking barbecue sauce in this shit, bro. I'm gonna tell her to lay off of the barbecue sauce too much. Mm. I need to start looking up challenges that I can do. I really do. Well, my plate's clean. I lit the pot clean. I lit the pot clean. See? I'm full. As desired, Scott. <laughs> okay. But. That shit's good. And I will point to put this up here again. Get the secret sauce. If you see it at Walmart, if you go to the commissary, if you see it at Target, get it. It's hella good. But. <clears throat> yep. So that's pretty much what's been going on. Halloween's coming up. Oh shit, I thought it was gonna show. Um Halloween's coming up. Not really much doing much for Halloween. My nephews are supposed to go trick or treating or something. I just gave my brother some candy so he can give to them. Um Oh my appointment was um Tuesday. No. Wednesday. I had an appointment. I was trying to get my SSI, but yeah, and I had an appointment for my appointment and stuff like that because I wear glasses. 
and just like they had to dilate my eye they had to um you know like put eye drops in my eyes you know how to do a full eye exam and all that shit oh i still feel weird but yeah that's just been going on uh we just got blinds and for the uh we just got blinds for the pool room and we went grocery shopping yesterday, got Ella's food and all that. We about to, we gonna have us some chicken tonight for dinner. And yeah, I've been talking to my friends a little bit. They doing all right. It's just been a real relaxed week. And I think that's, it's fair to say that it's been a lot of relaxing days. Some I had to work, some I didn't. But, you know, either I'm busy half the time or, you know, I'm just hella bored and it's just like my whole mood and my whole just demeanor is just down because it's like, I want to do something. I just don't want to sit here all day. And then when I'm not sitting there all day, I'm up working. It's like, what the fuck, bro? I can't. Uh, y'all understand where I'm coming from? Like, do y'all, do y'all, y'all really understand where I'm coming from? I don't know. Hold on, I'm gonna put this plate down. Alright, just put it, my plate up and everything. But, yeah. Ain't shit been going on. Bored as hell, still at the house. Uh, I tried to. still trying to connect my PS4, my PS4 so we can play online for gaming. And, um, yeah, try to do that still so I can start gaming. And my laptop, trying to see if that will work, but ain't much. And vlogs, like I said, ain't nothing really much vlogs, so that's why I ain't vlogging. But, um, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like. Hey, Bobo, you here? You here? Okay. Well, she ain't here. But, all right. Like, comment, subscribe. Hit that bell for notification. And thanks for watching my muffin. And I'll see you in the next video. Okay, that was out. But, yeah. Deuces.